with another video and we have the chic beauty box first of all i thought i canceled it i really did think i canceled it at least i thought i did but i guess i didn't so i was super excited when i saw it in the mail box but there must be something extra in here because it came in the packaging versus just the cute little small pink box that it usually comes in. So let's see what we got, guys. All right. Oh, there's another palette in here. And I think I knew this because I did get... So what prompted it was I didn't think I was getting this box anymore. But then I got um, an email that says, make your choices because you get to choose. And that's what I did. So I'm going to start with that last and then we're going to start with the Chic Beauty Box, okay? And it's a little, it's a little matte this, this time versus the typical like satin, shiny, glossy finish that they usually have, but that's okay. That's okay. And this box is bi-monthly, so that way you don't feel overwhelmed. And I like that because I'm feeling like my consumerism is, too much sometimes it's, it's getting too much so i don't know so anyway let's get into the box so here's the card and let's see what is it saying to me Ew. okay okay so it doesn't necessarily have what's in the box but it does give you an opportunity to get some credits on the website so all right let's see what we got on top project lip plump and fill shade chase it's a liner lip liner okay guess i can show you guys huh <laughs> Let's see. Can I open it though? I gotta take this tag off. I don't know if the tip is any indicator, but let's see. Okay. I don't know if it has a makeup smell. But that's cool. It kind of matches. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. It kind of matches the lip balm that I got in my last box. In my, um,. A Laura Beauty box. That's kind of pinky. That's nice. And it's a lip liner. It's really creamy though. Okay, so that's different. Let's see up next. Up next, we got the what is this? The Beauty for Certain? I thought this was Beauty for All. Or maybe not. I don't know. Yeah, who is she? Is that, um,. Bia, what's her name? I don't know. I forgot her name. I think this is her makeup line. But let's see. What is this? It's a cream blush, number 27. Y'all know I still don't know how to use these creams and liquids yet, but your girl is going to get there. So I don't know how much this stuff costs. Okay, that's kind of sad. But I really do like the packaging on these products. I have a, well, I received like some lip products before, so yeah. Let's see. Oh, this is pretty. And this is like a blush right up my alley. Definitely right up my alley. It seems like it's like, it's creamy. Well, duh, it's a cream. But like, it doesn't seem like it's gonna move so that, I don't know, it just seems, it feels like it'd be really, really easy to work with. And oh, I was looking for this color earlier. Ugh. I'll have to try it, but there's the, the blush. Doesn't smell like anything, but that's cool. So yeah, so that's cool. I got a blush. I got a blush, and of course, I have a napkin. Okay. Yeah, it's been so long since I've been in front of the camera that I don't even know what to do no more. All right, up next, we have a Slim Brow Pencil by Physicians Formula. Oh my gosh, Karen, I need to turn this light down. Yeah. Oh, 
Oh, it's medium brown. Okay, so it's a duh. I thought it was just a brow brush, but I did say pencil did anyway. Acting all brand new. So it does have a spoolie on the end, and it is medium brown. Y'all know this is getting gifted because I don't do brows. Ooh, it's like a heart. Oh. Ow! I would not put that in my brows, homie. That was hard. It's like I'm digging a lead pencil into my hand. Like, quite literally. But there's the brown. So, yeah. I don't know about that. Ooh, that hurts. But the spoolie's nice. Is it soft, though? Even the spoolie is rough. Like, it shouldn't... Like, it probably shouldn't be, like, soft, but she's. Yeah, I don't know if she's going to like that one, but that's definitely a giveaway. All right, the last item inside the actual box that fit in the box is the Physicians Formula Rosé All Day. It's a multi-use highlighter. Oh, this is pretty. That's really pretty. It's called Petal Glow. I love a good highlighter. If I can get it out. The packaging is really pretty though. Oh, that is really pretty. See, it has the flowers on there. That is really pretty. Oh, and it's like. Well, that's cool. Okay, so it comes with a puff in the bottom. Oh, no, that's not a puff at all. It's a little brush. All right, let me take it out. Ooh, but that's nice, though. See? It's like a little a little mini fan brush. But here is the thin boss with the little rose. Can you see? That's pretty. It's like a um, coppery color. It's dry, like a copper. Yeah, it's like a copper color. I don't know if you can tell over here. No. My lighting is all jacked up, but that's okay. Yeah, it's nice. That's nice. Huh, all right. I know. I do know that that is a drugstore brand. Like, you can find that in, like, Walmart and stuff like that, so... All right, and the piece that didn't fit in the box, I think I'm positive this is Ace Beauté. I think this is what I chose. I don't remember. But yeah, this is the Ace Beauté Flare Palette. Their packaging is so pretty. It's always so pretty. And then their color stories are amazing. And I already know this palette's about to be fire. So yeah, matches the outside. It does come with the mirror. And see, like I said, like the color story is gorgeous. It's just gorgeous. Yes. So when you want to do something flare, when to add some flare to your look, that makes more sense than what I just said. Yes, that purple, I don't know what that says, but it's really pretty. It's a lot deeper on camera. And this cider, this cider color isn't as yellow. It's a little bit more mustard. Mustard. Oh my God, these colors are so pretty. Oh, do I want to swatch this? Yes, I do. This forest green, well, it's called forest pine. It's so pretty. And this sherbet. I want some shoes this color. Don't judge me. But that lime highlighter green, I love it. Let's see what else we got here. Ooh, this Bayberry. It's like a pressed shimmer. Ooh, that looks really pretty. Can't really get it. There we go. That's the true color. Super pretty. And they're soft. 
Soft, 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 soft. Ooh, this saffron color, it's like a orange, like a orange red. Is that better? Guys, I'll fix my lighting. Don't touch me. Super, super, super pretty. Like, I love their palettes. You can't go wrong with their palettes. You can't go wrong with this box, neither. All right, so in the box, this time we got. So we got the Ace Beauté palette. So pretty. We got the Physician's Formula Highlighter. The Kareem Blush, which I'm kind of excited to try this. Like, this color is so up my alley. Ugh. And it's like subtle, but I know it will pop at the same time. Can't wait to use that. Then we got the lip liner and the hard as a rock brow pencil. Like, let me know if you've used this. Is it genuinely that hard or maybe I just got a bad one or you have to like work it up, rub it and I, I don't know, but yeah, we'll try to guess what. I don't know. She'll have to make that one work. But let me know if you guys are still getting this box. If you love it. Are you going to try it? Don't forget to like. Comment below. Let's talk. Let's talk. Can we talk? Don't judge me. Um. Yeah. And I will see you guys next time. Peace. Yeah. I gotta forget my wipes all the freaking time. Oh my gosh. But yeah, that one was way too hard.